name is Joanne with Texas A&M AgriLife Extension and I am the Fallon Community Health County Center Agent for the County of Hidalgo. Today we are going to be making a turtle pillow. This turtle pillow will be donated to So Many Smiles. So Many Smiles is an organization that supports children with serious medical conditions. The Master Plan Volunteers is a group of volunteers that teach individuals how to sew. The Master Calling Volunteers from Dow County decided to make this as a community service project. The Painted Turtle is a year-round medical specialty camp that gives children with serious illness an experience that fosters personal growth, self-confidence, and possibility. Camp is a place where they can go fishing, canoeing, horseback riding, and more, all in the environment that provides outstanding medical care and support. With that, they get to take a pillow with them. If you would like to be a part of this community service project, please contact our office. Thank you. Enjoy the video. Okay, so you're going to iron your fabric, then place your pattern on the fabric on fold. Cut two of this turtle outline. Okay, this is piece C. You would also iron your fabric, then pin the pattern on top of your fabric, you just need one piece of fabric for this pattern. Next, for piece D, you would also iron your fabric, then place the fabric on fold. I'm using the rotary cutter. I found it more easier to go around the curves. So you cut in the outer as well as the inner. What you are going to have are two pieces of the turtle outline, two pieces of the oval outline, and one piece of the oval. The first step you're going to do is sew around the outside layer of the oval piece. After you're done with that, you will go to the iron to iron the seams and come back and top stitch with a 1 4 inch seam allowance. Then you're going to sew the oval opening with a basting stitch. This creates a unified piece which is easier to work with for the next step. The next step is you want to get your oval gathering along with the small oval and pin them in place. The next step is sew your gathering all around the seam. So in essence, it looks like this. Your next step is to pin the outer shell to part B and sew it around. Next, you put part A and part B together and sew around. Leave an opening on one side for turning and later stuffing. And you're done. So flip it over, iron it out, and you're ready to ship it off. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to our YouTube channel and like our Facebook page at AgriLife Extension Family Resources, Hidalgo County.